looking for a 1940 Ford Deluxe convertible. Here you go. Check this one out. This one appears to be very original looking when it was restored. It was restored not very long ago. It came to us as a trade-in out of Greensboro, North Carolina area. This particular car, let me get up on the color here to try to give you a good idea. It shows up a little more green in the pictures and the video than it really is. It, what it appears to be is the cloud mist gray, it was called, which would have been an original 1940 color. This gives you a pretty good idea of it kind of right here where you kind of get that gray green look. That's a pretty true color to what it shows up in person compared to the videos and the, the pictures. But yeah, if you, you know, take a look at it, check it out online. Cloud Mist Gray is what it appears to be. Um, very nice looking car. Like I said, recently restored, runs and drives out absolutely beautiful. Was pretty much brought back to what you would expect it to look like in 1940. Still powered by the flathead V8 underneath the hood, three speed manual transmission, shifter on the column. Uh, the interior in these, in 1940, as I understand, there was basically three options on the deluxes. And you could have gotten a broadcloth, a deluxe broadcloth, deluxe mohair. Both of those would have been in shades of tan. And then there was also a leather option, and just in saddle is the only way you could have got that one. Um, that was kind of discouraged by the company. And that was about a $35 to $40 option, if I believe. And this is how this one has been finished off, kind of with the saddle interior to it. They actually say there's probably more with the saddle leather interior these days than there were actually produced back from Ford because it's, it's a nice looking interior, easy to slide in and out. Probably wears a little better than the mohair. But beautiful car. I mean, look up and down. I'll show you something else. Look at how nice that door fits right there. And watch how easily and nicely it closes doesn't take much at all to swing it it latches nicely we'll start it up here so you can hear it run i'll open up the hood you can see how nice and tidy it is underneath there again 1940 ford deluxe convertible very original looking car just came into us on trade if you'd like it check out the still pictures you can see the underside the engine bay check out and just see how clean and solid this car is it is all steel by the way check out those still pictures at uniqueclassiccars.com feel free to call us to 507-386-1726 be happy to discuss the car what we know about it answer any questions that you may have very nice runner and driver once again previous owner enjoyed this car did drive it some and it was time to move on to something else and actually trade it in on a big, cool Cadillac, let's put it that way. Come around, I'm going to show you this door opening and closing too. Again, look at how nice the fit is. Don't always see that on the older cars or back in the 40s. And watch how easily this door closes also. It doesn't take much to swing it and have it latch properly, fit nice and tight. Top is in good shape. You can check out those still pictures of the top, uh, interior of the top, the outside, obviously, exterior of it. Check out the top picks, see the condition, all those still pictures. Once again, uniqueclassiccars.com. Does also have a manual top. It is vacuum, so it takes a little bit for it to go back and go down, but it does work. The car also has a heater in it. I'll show you down below if you kind of look through the steering wheel down there is heater doors that open up a uh, fan does blow I didn't really let it run long enough or see if the heater worked or not but the fan does blow coming out of that heater and everything very stock looking dash pretty much kept how original the two bar steering wheel check out this looks like the original steering wheel with the Ford Deluxe logo on the center does have the spotlight on the side there spotlight does work Check out the door cards and the handles, just everything. If it's not original, definitely seems to be error correct. Very cool, 1940. Ford Deluxe Convertible, let's fire this baby up. All right, and down here, this was actually a lock. You'd turn on and off for this switch here. 
I have it unlocked so we can flip that switch on. So we're going to flip that up. Now on. Here's a start button. And there you have it. Here, I'll smooth that flathead idles, or maybe you can't. We'll slip around and, like I said, open that hood. Check out that dash. I mentioned the heater. There's a heater. There's the doors you'd open. Right here is actually the switch for the fan. Which you can hear blow out of that. Turn that off. This is the choke. Choke does work. Uh, this would have been the lighter. This would be your lights. Lights do work also. And throttle here. from back in the day that I have not played with can't confirm that works or not uh, if you remember the antenna on these this little switch up here we turn the antenna so you go ahead and flip the antenna up leave it up to get reception when you're driving don't want the radio on just flip it whoops don't go too far flip it down so it's in the center there very cool a rear view mirror Again, check out. It's amazing how those doors close. Check out all the still pictures. Like I said, uniqueclassiccars.com. Listen to that per. Or give us a call. Once again, that number is 507 386 1726. I'm going to go ahead and just kind of pause this video a second. I'll pop that hood so you can see the end of it. Here, I'll smooth that flathead runs. All right, hood popped. First of all, look at how nice it's finished off under here also. There you go. Look at that flathead. Look how smooth it is. There you have it. 1940 Ford Deluxe Convertible. UniqueClassicCars.com, or like I said, give us a call, 507-386-1726.